Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a tutorial on removing grain and or noise from your photographs and the best way to do it in Photoshop. So to start off with, I would always recommend, as usual, to shoot raw because there is a much easier way to do this in camera raw. So yeah, I would definitely recommend that. So the first thing I like to do is duplicate the background layer. And then I know it doesn't look like there's much noise in this photograph, but as we zoom in, we can see that there is a fair bit. So the best way to do this is to go filter, noise, reduce noise. Okay, so when that's up, we do have two options here. We have basic and advanced. So advanced is really good if you've got a lot of color noise in the image and you need to remove that because it provides you with a per channel option so you can remove from certain color channels red green and blue uh, for this particular image though I'm just going to stick to basic because we don't really have a lot of color grain or color noise in there so I'm just going to move these around a little bit just to see what works best okay So I think I'm happy with that. It is going to make the image look a little bit smoother, which is okay. It's not the worst thing we can do to the image, but I'm going to show you guys how to get it a little bit sharper as well afterwards. So we're just going to press OK. And I'm going to show you guys what that has done. So that was the original. And that's what it looks like now. So definitely a drastic change there. So for the next part, uh, I'm going to duplicate the image again and go filter, other, high pass. And this is just the way that I like to sharpen my images. And it's a really good way for images that do have a bit of noise. So I'm going to leave that probably at around 4.5 actually. And, click. and then we're going to go to the blending modes and click overlay. And just move that down a little bit in the opacity. And as we can see, that has brought back quite a bit of the sharpness in the image. So we'll zoom out, and I'm just going to take another snapshot and show you guys before and after. So we'll zoom back in a little bit more, because it's hard to see from further away. But this is the original, and this is what it looks like now. So it has removed a fair bit of the grain. There's not a great deal you can do with JPEG images to bring back a lot of the detail, especially if there is a lot of noise. Um, they're very hard to work with so as I said shoot with raw and you shouldn't have too much of a problem um, it is a lot easier to remove noise in camera raw but this is generally the way I like to do it with JPEG images and yeah I hope that helps you guys if you're a little bit stuck on how to do that but anyway thanks very much for watching guys and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and hopefully I'll have some more tutorials for you soon I'll see you next time bye